Here's the gauge cluster after doing the variant coating. I also updated the mileage to match my old one. Currently in comfort mode. As you can see, we got some miscellaneous gauges and oil pressure, torque and boost like you would on a GT1, GT2, lap timer, G-force, uh, fuel economy like you normally would have. We've got a GPS compass, tire pressure once you drive, and then all your stuff here. Um, I'd be straight on with the screen, but unfortunately the glare's bad. Now we'll go to sport mode, and I like this one particularly because it goes red. There's driver assistance. I'll just scroll through the menus here. There's your G-Force and lap time. That one goes red. My car is automatic. When it turns on, it turns traction control off and goes into sport mode, so it'll always be red. Uh, I'd assume Eco's green. Yep, Eco's green. I think this one's purple. Oh, blue. It must be custom that's purple, yep. So there's purple. So it's, it's nice to have that nice color variant that way it actually looks good. But the, uh, the supervision screen is just fantastic in person. But I've got the electronic suspension turned off, the lane keep assist warning, and smart cruise control. So it's, it's now a, a GT display, just a little cooler. And it matches beautifully with the GT1, GT2 screen.